Hi, I'm Romain Jordan, and in this video, I'm going to talk about web transaction analysis or how you can monitor the performance of a web based application in our data center or hosted in the cloud with AppResponse 11. Riverbed NPM can help troubleshooting application performance issues. So, we configured the SLAs for our most critical application, and we can track the performance for group of group of users. Here, it looks like our remote users are experiencing a problem. Let's deep dive and investigate further. So for that, I'm going to select the App Insight that brings me to App Response. The response composition chart shows some spikes in user response time for the IMS app. So now let's take a bigger time range and check whether this problem happened earlier. It appears that we have had some problems for some time. We want to have a look at the IMS application on our page views. The true plot graph displays each and every response time here on the right. No sampling, full fidelity metrics. It helps us visualizing the pattern of performance degradation starting around 11. So now let's have a look at the page views. So we can see that we can the, we have the page views, the response time, the server response time, and the clients, but also the networking, which is the most the contributor, which is okay for a download page. But if we go to the home page, now we can see that network is also responsible for the bad performance. Fortunately, the waterfall diagram is helping us troubleshooting and identifying the heaviest object. It seems that this app could be also a good candidate for application acceleration, but that's another story. Thanks for listening to this video. I encourage you to join us on the community website, community.rivet.com, to learn more. Thank you.